Hello, this is Eric at Prince Short Ford, and we're taking a look at the brand new 2021 Ford Bronco in an Outer Banks trim and powered by a 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine, providing you with excellent power and fuel efficiency. Coming with running boards down below so you can have an easier time getting in, and a soft top roof that can be folded back to give you some open air experience. And looking at the back where you have your tailgate with your fifth full size spare sitting on the back ready for use. And the swings open to reveal your cargo area, which is pretty spacious and can always be expanded by folding down your rear seats. Here you have your door bags so that even when you have them off, you can store them in the back safely and keep them in place. You have your tie-down hooks or points with a little lasso picture on them. And then you have this little compartment down here where you have your jack and some extra storage. Then looking into the back seat where you have spacious seating for three with a nice cloth interior. You have your window switches here in the middle, of course, because the window or the doors are removable. And then you have a USB, USB-C, and 110 volt power outlet. This vehicle does have a remote start, so no need to go outside on those cold mornings to warm up your uh, SUV. And then looking in, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, of course. Now sitting in the vehicle with your running and looking at the steering wheel on the right hand side you have your hands free phone controls as well as your controls for your center info screen here where you can cycle through your uh, trip and fuel information with your fuel economy, trip 1 and 2 info, average speed and auto start stop status. Then you have all of your off road information here which is probably pretty important for a vehicle that is more off road oriented. And then you have your navigation controls, phone controls, audio controls, and settings for your screen and some other features around your vehicle. As well as having my view, which is a sort of favorite screen for any of those subcategories for ease of access. But then moving on to the left where you have your cruise controls with your lane keeping system and your hands-free radio controls. And then moving on to your center, your infotainment screen, which is radio series and Bluetooth capable. So you have some options there. You have your Bluetooth phone controls, navigation screens, you're hopefully not going to get lost, whatever apps you may have installed, settings for your screen and some other features around your vehicle and your general vehicle features such as driver assistance, zone lighting, towing, and owner's manual. And then shifting into reverse, you do have a backup camera with a full 360 view so you can see all around your SUV. And then you have a dynamic hitch view so you can zoom in and have an easier time hooking up a trailer or something of the sort. Above that you have your uh, trail turn mode or tra trail turn assist so if you're on a uh, tight turn or road and you need to turn around uh, this will assist you in doing so and then you have your traction control shut off hazards and up here you have a mounting point for a sort of rail system where you can put a uh, GoPro or whatever other device you want on there um, and then moving down from your screen you have your media controls with your camera view uh, auto start stop shut off, park assist sensor shut off, and then you have your climate controls with dual zone front climate and heated front seats so you can stay cozy in the colder months. Then down below you have a cubby area here with a USB and USB-C so you can plug something into power or charge from there. Um, then you have your main shifter for your 10 speed automatic transmission with select shift on the side so you can manually shift through your gears and your very important 4x4 selector where you have uh, two high, four low, and four high, uh, as well as your trail control mode, which is a sort of um, cruise control for off road settings. Um, and then you can switch through your GOAT modes here that goes over any terrain. So you have normal, eco, sport, slippery, mud ruts, and sand. So you can customize your driving experience a bit there. Uh, depending on the terrain and then you have core two, two cup holders a uh, plate here to commer commemorate uh, the vehicle from the factory a sturdy grab handle there your window and mirror controls here because of course the doors come off and it wouldn't make sense to mount them there and then you have your lockable center compartment slash armrest here with a removable tray 12 volt power outlet and plenty of space for all of your stuff and being lockable because of course you can take the doors off the roof off everything uh, so some added security is nice and then last but not least looking up you have six upfitter switches here which can be wired up however you please but that should cover our look at the interior so now if you're interested feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day